5 minus 21 under square root and all under square root. How to simplify this radical? To simplify such questions, what we do? We write this number in terms of a plus b. Then plus minus the square root we can write it as a times b under square root times 2. Then we can convert it into a plus minus b whole square and then we can remove the square root with this square. Now 5 minus 21 means 21 we can write it as 7 times 3 under square root under square root. Now if you divide 7 times 3 by 4 and multiply it by 2 then what does this mean? This 4 is also under square root that means this 4 will be 2. This 4 can be written as then 2 square under square root and we remove this square root with this square. So it comes outside this root and then we remove this 2 with this 2. So 7 times 3 divided by 4 then times 2 outside the root equals 7 times 3 under square root. No change in the number. So let us write it like this. Now 5 minus 2 this we can write it as 7 upon 2 times 3 upon 2 under square root then all under square root. Now can we write 5 in terms of 7 upon 2 plus 3 upon 2 if you add these two fractions LCM is 2 7 plus 3 it is 10 upon 2 2 times 5 is 10 so it becomes 5. So now we can write 5 as 7 upon 2 plus 3 upon 2 minus 2 and this is in the form of a times b under square root and this we can write, write it as square root of a times square root of b. So square root of 7 upon 2 times square root of 3 upon 2 under square root. Now if we write a as a square under square root then there is no change. Why? Because we can remove this square root with this square. So we can write 7 upon 2 as 7 upon 2 raised to the power of 2. We can write the square outside of it. Then plus 3 upon 2 under square root raised to the power of 2 minus 2 times 7 upon 2 under square root times 3 upon 2 under square root. Then all under square root. Now this is in the form of a square plus b square minus 2ab. And this is an algebraic expression. We can write it as a minus b whole square. So we have 7 upon 2 under square root minus 3 upon 2 under square root whole square under square root. Now remove this square root with this square. So we have 7 upon 2 under square root minus 3 upon 2 under square root. Let us rationalize the denominator because radical in the denominator means that it is not a real number. 7 upon 2 under square root we can write it as 7 under square root upon 2 under square root minus square root of 3 upon square root of 2. We multiply and divide it by square root of 2. So 7 times 2 square root of 2 times square root of 7 will be square root of 14 and square root of 2 times square root of 2 will be square root of 2 square minus square root of 6 upon square root of 2 square or square root of 14 upon 2 minus square root of 6 upon 2 or we can write it as 1 upon 2 bracket square root of 40 minus square root of 6. This is our answer. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.